We've had a very fun musical themed show today in honor of CJ Newsom. And CJ, there's something we forgot to mention earlier yes. about dancing at your theater. Yes. So we just built a dance floor in our theater. We took some seating that was over to the side. And I mean, it's fantastic. We got a, a bar set, a little uh, bar stools, and, mm -hmm. and uh, we actually sell alcohol. We sell beer and wine. Oh, that's good. I didn't know that. Yeah. Yeah, so, uh, and then on Saturday nights after uh, our one of our shows called America's Top Country Hits, right after the show, 10.30, from 10.30 to 1.30 in the morning, we do Branson's Biggest Little Honky Tonk. That is so fun. Uh, yeah, and, and uh, we have our band come and play, and it's it's almost a request section a lot of times. We'll, we'll have people shout out, you know, their favorite artists or, or genre and things like that, and... I got to brag on my band. Uh, they're pretty amazing, honestly. They can, they can do that. Can I just say one thing that impresses me right now about that? When I lived in Branson, it was hard pressed to find anything open after 1030. Yes. And now you're playing till 130. That must be great for all the local entertainers, too. Yeah, you know, see a need, fill a need. Yeah. Uh, and it, it, but it's fun to come and unwind. You know, you're, you're done with the show, and it's just having a great old time so with some friends. It, can audience members come, or can people come off the street and come and also They can. Stay? Like, uh, So if you come see the show, the show's at 8 o'clock. Uh, if you come see the show, you can get free admission into it. We're, but afterwards, when it starts at 10.30, we're doing a $5 cover charge. That's it. They walk in the door, 5 bucks. Here you go. And, you know, grab you some concessions and uh, a beer if you mm -hmm. want, and, and have some fun. That is such a great idea. Thank yeah. you for filling that need because yeah. that was never an option for me when I lived in Branson. It was like you finished the show and then everything was closed. Yeah, I know. So I, know. I, I enjoy that option. $5 cover, 1030s every Saturday at the Americana Theater. That's right. Guys, go check that out. That's so much fun. Do a little two-stepping and make requests, which is the best part. Right. They love that. They'll stay for hours, you know, just going, well, I want to hear this song. <gasps> do you do this? My favorite thing about Branson Entertainers is jam sessions. Yes. And That's what it feels like. It's where they shine. Yeah. You know, because you're like... And it surprises the artists themselves that sometimes because they don't know they've got it in them. And they do. And they do. And they they do. really do. Okay, well, yeah. sticking with musical themes, um, we're going to be seeing split decisions. And these are going to be, I'm just reading this for the first time, uh, we'll be seeing pairs of instruments. And which instrument do we like better? That is random, and I love it. <laughs> I was not expecting this, and producer Jake has surprised me yet again. Okay. Let's look. Pairs of instruments. The castanets. Or the tambourine? Oh, 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 hands down tambourine. And why? Uh, because I used to play the tambourine a bunch in, in church, actually. Love the tambourine. It was, it's a way to get energy out. And if you don't play an instrument, you know, because I mean, I, I play guitar, but I, I, don't, I don't play guitar. And I love the tambourine. I, I have music in my body, and I yes, just love, I love to exhibit that. And you know, I was going to say, I was going to agree with you, because if I was thrown into a band, the one thing I could play in that band would be like Davy Jones and the Monkeys. Just play the tambourine. Yeah, that's right. You just know, and you know the song, and yeah. you don't know the chords, so. <laughs> I'm with you 100%. <laughs> okay, the accordion or the xylophone? Wow, that's a, that's, that's a weird one. The accordion or the xylophone? I guess I'd go with xylophone. Okay, why? Just uh, well, nice. um, <laughs> well um, I'm not hugely familiar with how to play either one of those, but I would imagine, as a musician, I would imagine that the xylophone would be a little bit easier to play. True. I, a, a, accordion, you would have to have a lot of coordination for that. And, I mean, I'm not sure I can chew gum and walk I, at the same I time. I know, right? I'm picking the accordion only because I love polka music. Okay. I love polka. Okay. I, there I said I admitted it on the show. <laughs> I love me some polka. <laughs> the harp or the violin? Oh my gosh, now that's oh, a hard one. Oh, wow. I, I normally think of these in personal uh, terms like, what would I do? But I guess I'd have to go with the violin because uh, the violin, they're both beautiful though. Uh, they both add a really neat flavor to the music. Yeah. But the violin has is, is always been my favorite in both country and classical. It's exhibited in so many different ways. Uh, when I did my Patsy Cline show, um, we we uh, showed off the violin and the cello a lot Ooh. in some of her music, and it just adds a beautiful, rich flavor to the music. I love that. I am going with the harp only because I love my dear friend of Branson, Catherine Haygood. She plays the yes. harp so beautifully, and she makes it look effortless. Oh. And to me, it is so hard because all the strings look the same to me, uh -huh. and she will play the most beautiful song and just go, beep, boop, beep, boop, beep. Like, how do you know which string to hit? Well, she, you know, she, she plays 10 instruments. Yeah, she's, the Hagoods are all amazing, I don't but, know. oh, she harmonica plays and flute. flute and, and I don't know. Uh, harmonica uh, flute, what do you think? Harmonica. 
I'm going with harmonica too because I think I can play that. Blues. Burp, 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 burp. Oh man. <laughs> burp, 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 burp. <laughs> Organ or the piano? Piano. Piano, piano yeah, yeah. See, because I can chord on the piano. Tickle those ivories. I, see, I, I took lessons for years and still can't do much on the piano. Oh, what an instrument. Okay, saxophone or trumpet? Sax. I love a good sax solo. Oh, it's beautiful. I mean, like, Reba had a lot of sax intros and different artists have a lot of, it adds so much. Banjo or fiddle? We're running out of time. Fiddle. I'm gonna go with fiddle too, because I also love, you know, all the shows in Branson that have yeah. the fiddles. Yeah, oh gosh. Uh, definitely CJ, down to thank you so much. <laughs> for feeling today. You've been an amazing job. We appreciate every time you come in. Thanks for tuning in to Ozark's Fox Sam. Whatever you do, have a wacky and wonderful Wednesday.